Hello again, Bill Stout with BillStoutSalesCars.com at Schofield Hyundai West in Wichita, Kansas. And we're talking about 10 things you ought to know before buying your next car. And today we're on number six, and that is how to do your homework. Yes, I said homework, and there's no test involved here. Or maybe there is, depending on how you look at buying a car. But the homework on price. Now, the reason I bring this up is simple. The days of the $10,000 discount and the negotiating over money are really in the past because with the internet being what it is now, dealers set a price based on a very low profit margin. Now, I'm not telling you they all do this. In fact, we all know there's dealers out there who are still looking to make a big, heavy sum on selling you a car. But if you walk into a, a dealership, a reputable dealership, and think that they're going to take six or seven thousand dollars off the price of a pre-owned vehicle or a new car, you're just not living in reality. You have to understand there is a very low markup on cars. New cars usually even less so than the, than the used ones. So, how do you know what a fair value is? Well, there are plenty of ways to look at it. Obviously, there are the online guides like Kelly Blue Book and NADA and Edmunds, which will give you some real values. Now, I would stay away from some of these third parties like TrueCar.com. The, these are advertisers. They are not in the business of selling cars or determining values. What their business is, is to figure out how to get you into a showroom. And that's okay, but you can save yourself some time and quite frankly some money if you just go to a dealership to someone you like and trust and let them help you get the real value up front. There's no secret here. It's not a big game. We're not, we're not out to try to take blood from you come in. I'm looking for a fair profit, a fair deal for you, and the right car for the right price with a better buying experience. If you want to know the value of a car, then you have to know the NADA value for your bank or whatever. Feel free to look them up. There's no secrets. But understand, these books do not write laws. They are exactly that, guides. They don't buy and sell vehicles. So, market value is based on availability, condition and history, equipment, options, and how long the vehicle's been in stock. If you can remember those simple things, you'll save yourself a lot of things. I look forward to seeing you when you are ready to find out the price of the new or used car you want to buy. And any other questions you might have, just call the number on the bottom of the screen or visit me online at BillStoutSalesCars.com. Have a great day.